And what you and I do on a daily basis, amen. I show up to work every day on a daily basis, amen. I get up and get the food with that on a daily basis, amen. I do the best job I can on a daily basis. I read my Bible on a daily basis. Oh, y'all don't hear what I'm saying. Y'all don't want to in the sky somewhere. But I'm going to tell you, God, because I operate like that. Child, you got to put some time in, amen, somebody. You got to put some time in. in your life and in my life. That's how God does it. Amen. Don't overlook church fellowship. Don't overlook prayer time. Don't overlook reading your word. Don't overlook doing your job to the best of your ability. These are the small things. Are they really small? Don't pass by meditation. Don't pass by serving others. Don't brush off the importance of faithfulness. Amen. He shows up in the small things. There's more to what you do than what you see. The Lord is trying to get you ready for the next for the next phase of your life. I said the Lord is trying to get you ready for the next phase of your life. I thought, you know, there were three phases to Moses' life. There was the there was the, the phase in Egypt. Moses was 40. By the time Moses went to Midian, Moses was, by the time he was ready to serve, Moses was 80 years old. Amen. So don't you put no time limit, no age limit on when God can use you. Amen. You can accomplish more in the next five years than you have in the previous 40 years. You have to get your mind on God. Amen, somebody. You have to not overlook the small things. And remember there is more to what you do than what you see. Amen. The Lord is trying to get you ready for the next phase 